Good evening and welcome to the public information meeting for the State Road 33 Green Swamp Bridge Project. Naziru Isaac is the Florida Department of Transportation's project manager. The purpose of tonight's public meeting is to share information about the proposed project and to provide time to answer questions with interested parties. There will be a brief overview of the project and afterwards you are encouraged to view the exhibits and ask questions. If you did not receive a project information flyer previously in the mail, please feel free to take one from the sign-in table. This meeting is being held to afford all citizens the right to understand the project and comment on concerns to the Florida Department of Transportation. The meeting is being held to comply with Title VI of the Civil Rights Act of 1964 and Title VIII of the Civil Rights Act of 1968 as amended. Public participation is solicited without regard to race, color, national origin, age, sex, religion, disability, or family status. Persons wishing to express their concerns relative to FDOT compliance with Title VI and or Title VIII may do so by contacting the FDOT, District 5, Title VI and VIII Coordinator Jennifer Smith at 719 South Woodland Boulevard, Deland, Florida 32720 or the Florida Equal Opportunity Office 605 Suwanee Street, Room 260, Mail Station 65, Tallahassee, Florida 32399-0450. All inquiries or complaints will be handled according to FDOT procedure and in an expeditious manner. This project includes the replacement of the State Road 33 bridge over Green Swamp. The bridge was originally built in 1956. In 2014, traffic was estimated at 6,200 vehicles a day with 33% of those vehicles being trucks. An inspection in 2014 showed the roadway to be functionally obsolete and structurally deficient. This project does not involve adding travel lanes. The Green Swamp Bridge is located south of County Road 561 and north of County Road 474. The project will start 500 feet on either side of the bridge. The approaches will match the existing roadway with one 12-foot travel lane, a 5-foot paved shoulder, and a 5-foot unpaved shoulder in each direction. The typical bridge section is expected to have a 12-foot travel lane and 10-foot paved shoulder in each direction. The FDOT may require additional right-of-way to complete the project. The existing roadway on either side of the bridge has 12-foot travel lanes with 5-foot shoulders in each direction. The proposed roadway on either side of the bridge will have 12-foot travel lanes with 5-foot paved shoulders. There will also be guardrail and standard clearing and grubbing in each direction. The existing bridge has 12-foot travel lanes with 3-foot shoulders in each direction. The proposed bridge will have 12-foot travel lanes with 10-foot shoulders in each direction. During construction, State Road 33 will need to be closed to through traffic between County Road 474 and State Road 50. Local traffic access will be maintained. Through traffic will be detoured using County Road 474, US 27, and State Road 50.
Green Swamp is a critical recharge area for the Floridan Aquifer, as well as a source of the Hillsboro, Withlacuchi, Ocklawaha, and Peace Rivers, located within the Project Corridor. Protecting the swamp is a priority during design and construction. The FDOT will employ best management practices for controlling stormwater runoff, which protects against unwanted debris entering the swamp. Additionally, the project will go through a strict environmental permitting process prior to construction. This project is currently in design. The design phase is expected to be completed in 2016. The estimated construction cost is about $3 million. This project is currently funded for letting in January of 2019, with construction expected to start by mid-year 2019 and to be completed in early 2020. However, that date could change depending on the completed design. For information about this project, please visit www.cflroads.com. This website is the FDOT's living platform to keep the public informed of ongoing and future projects. You are encouraged to visit this website which contains the links to easily access online information and to stay current with the status of the project. Once you have accessed the project website, you will be able to view the current project schedule, contact information, and access project files such as this presentation. On the main page from the pull-down menu labeled Road, select State Road 33 and then click in the search box. When the new page opens, click the link labeled Design and then select a project number for this project, which is 433-860-1. There are several ways you can submit comments to participate in the project design process. You can mail your comment form to Public Involvement Coordinator Megan Oliveira at the address shown here and on the comment form. You can email Megan, the Public Involvement Coordinator, as shown here. Or you can go to www.cflroads.com and use the Submit Comments and Questions link on the project webpage. All comments received by Tuesday, September 6, 2016, will become part of the official public meeting summary. If you have questions or would like more information about this project, you may contact Naziru Isaac, the FDOT project manager, by mail, telephone, or email as shown here. You can also contact Megan Oliveira, the Consultant Public Involvement Coordinator, as shown here also. We'd like to thank you for attending this evening's design public meeting. Your comments are important to us. Please be sure to fill out a comment form. Please feel free to review the project exhibits and ask questions of the project team. This presentation will begin again in a few moments.